Hey guys, what the fuck is going on? What we're doing, we're working on the Piaggio. And what we're doing on the Piaggio is we're getting it running, seeing what we can do, you know? Um, hint, hint, yeet, yeet. If you know what I mean. <sighs> Alright guys, next day now. I'm just making it into one video rather than two because yeah. Um, I'm just working on the Piaggio, believe it or not. Finally, finally working on the Piaggio. Um, I just put the old mangled shoot up drive belt back on that we took off it because I know it fits. That one there seems a bit smaller, so I'm not going to put it on. But, um, there's the oil pump down there as well, look. How weird is that? It's covered in shit. Got to try and clean it off before I put all this back together properly. But that never undid, so the flower bolt's going to be fine with this. Need to do the nut up. So, mole grips, that, and them. Well, that's not mole grips, that is, but yeah. And that's not WD-40 or anything, but like that's that. Going to try and use that to start it without fuel for a bit. Spit will run. Yeah. Let me... Not sure if you guys heard the note right. That was sick. But yeah, let me just see if I can use my light all life hack for this quick and then I'll video again. <laughs> well, I'm um, cutting spark plug wires and sticking them straight onto spark plugs because we don't have a cap. That's safe, that safe is. Yeah, trust that's me. So safe. Right, let's focus on that thing, bro. Oh, focus camera. Yeah, look at that. Look at it. Perfect, that's the plug said. I cleaned the other day, guys, if you didn't see that. So if you haven't seen that, go watch other videos first, then come back, you know? And, uh, what's my video? Yeah. Find out where Actually, I... no, no, no. Watch this video, then go watch it, and you'll <laughs> see what I mean. Yeah. Don't stop watching. Don't get out of the groove, man. Mm. And I'm just wrapping electrical tape around that wire, because that'll get electrocuted if I put my hand down there. You know? Nice and also, it holds it on a bit more secure so it won't vibrate off, you know? Yeah. Good. Hi. Um, yeah, this is going on now. <laughs> Cleaned it all off inside. Belts all on and everything. There's no electric spot, so it's going to be hip only. But, going well so far, you know? Um, has one bolt. It turns out we've actually got six bolts for this one. Whoop whoop. The other moped only has four. It legit has two more bolts on our other moped, which we've been riding around perfectly safe through forests and stuff. Yeah, so it'll be fine. Hey. It'll be fine. Rich is a mechanic, remember, guys? Yeah, I'm a mechanic. So it'll be fine. Wow, what is life, boys? What is life? Yeah, what is life? So, what have we done so far then? We've. As you can see, it's like a bit wet. I think, so I think it's weave a bit is the only word I can say. Weave, yeah, um, that is literally. Yeah, um, that is it. No, what we've done so far. Their indicators are so bright. I'm, yeah. How can anyone see you? <laughs> no, just, just leave it out. But well, anyway. They're actually What we've done so far is we've just cleaned some shit. And, and put a spark plug in. Yeah. And I put a belt on, we put a belt on. Yeah. Put the brake clutch back there and put a belt on. Yeah, and we did that. Snapping loads of bolts. Why the fuck not? Exactly. <gasps> the casing's sat down flush now. It's actually flat. <sighs> so we can actually technically try and kick this now, but I'm not going to because. Talk to yourself, Brad. I'm over here too. Shit. I'm just trying to get a bolt in now. Just stretch that over like that. Boom. Mm -hmm. Fucking hell. Oh, yes please. Good Hannah Roberts. Mm-hmm. Oh, thanks Hannah. Good. Got a cigarette, guys, for free. Everyone say thanks, Hannah, in the comments. Thank you. Thanks, Hannah. Yeah. Hannah's supporting this YouTube video from the start, though. Mm-hmm. Sponsored by Hannah's Rollies. Mm-hmm. Best company going. So we get, that's how we get the revenue. It is. Trust me. Mm -hmm. Hannah's Rollies is a, actually a trademark company, isn't it? Yeah. Copyright. Yeah. 2019. I might get this kickstart and actually move it up. Like by oh no, you can't move it up any notches. It has to stay in position. Fuming. Yeah. I was gonna move up, move up a few notches so I can get a good better kick on it, but you can't. Because it's, it's notched on one side, round on the other. Oh fuck. Only kickstart I've ever seen to do that. But 
you know? You have to buy an aftermarket one for this pedal on specific one, which is gay. Yeah, but let's be honest. Who the fuck buys model specific parts? Who the fuck buys a moped in this state? Oh, hang on. Me. You do. <laughs> it's only a hundred quid. I shouldn't say that. I should, I should not have paid a hundred quid. Um, mm. It was only ten pounds. <laughs> yeah, we got it out of a cereal box. Yeah. Because that's that's the legit no, thing. Did we collected magazines with all pieces? <laughs> it was like Sun 950 Holidays. Yeah. But it was the Echo 950 mopeds. Literally. Legit. That should that should be a thing. Yeah. That should literally be a thing. Do you ask you... There? They've got a hold down strap for this thing like in transit. Yeah, that's great. So you can hold it down, except you can't stand it up because it doesn't have a stand. <laughs> <laughs> legit. Stand? You want to see? You want to see our stand? The exhaust. My fucking wall and the exhaust. That is our that is our moped stand at the moment. That made a nice noise. Mm. Satisfying. Mm -hmm. I just know it's in place. Yep. So when I said it was perfectly flush earlier, only the top part was perfectly flush. <laughs> <laughs> the bottom was not. <laughs> it uh, is now. So just getting people's opinions on this this beautiful piece Beast. of shit right here, right? Beast, is that or is that the most ugly looking moped in the world? Actually, when it's put together, they look fucking nice. Yeah. This one though. Yeah, this one. Though. Normal ones do. Yeah. But, you know, what can you do when you buy 950 moped from the Echo? Yeah. If anyone has any mopeds that they, you know... Want to donate. They want to donate, and we'll fix them up. And it'll be famous. What we'll do is if you give us your moped, give us the money to buy parts now, or buy the parts. Like, we'll fix them for free. Yeah, just so we can make some YouTube content. Yeah. Or not even mopeds, one, two, five, shit like that. Yeah, so basically... Maybe a VFR 800, but then I'm going to cut guarantee you getting it back. Yeah. <laughs> oh, also, if you've got a GSXF, a 750, it needs fixing. I don't know, perhaps it got stolen. You know, bring it back. Yeah, please. <laughs> I want my GSX back. <laughs> I need my GSX back. <sighs> right. So, yeah, we're going to get carry on with a bit of this. Um, and then, yeah, yeah. We'll, uh, we'll update the fuck out of you over the next... I don't know, Good day. I'm going to pass more in there. Also, just to our own guiltiness, me and Brad have been planning on doing this moped. Like, we literally have had days. Say, we've we've, we've, we've had days reserved. Literally, he told me, don't do anything tomorrow because we're going to work on this moped. And you know what we end up doing? Driving the other moped through the forest. It's great. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to get done into this and, yeah, get back to you. See? Glug, 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 glug. I'm a bit bored watching Brad. Fuck about with fuel pipes over here because all he's got to do now is just change the pipe, but it's a lot awkward. So he's got a knife in his hand and he's going a bit crazy. So what I'm doing is uh, I'm switching up the video a bit and I'm going to work on this because why the fuck not? So all I'm going to do is I'm literally going to, as you can see, there's those bolts and stuff. I'm going to take every bolt off, see what happens, and we're going to see if we can charge this battery, which is dead, with a 12 with a car battery charger. Can't see why not probably work perfectly fine warning no under 14 year olds luckily i don't pick up 14 year olds anymore so yeah i haven't had a, I haven't had a, quarter, I haven't had a quarter in so long <laughs> yes so yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna have a little bit of fun with this and see what happens i've never done it before so we're gonna give it a try um i can't really leave the phone recording anywhere so i'm just going to keep updating you guys yeah see. right so this is it i've taken these these bolts off here so this is what the inner workings of an electric scooter looks like. Okay, this is all gibberish to me. I have no idea what I'm fucking doing right now, but it's going to be fun. Look at these batteries, like. They are 12 volts. They're rechargeable as well. Oh no, we can fully use them on a motorbike. What the fuck? This thing is going to yeet. Right, anyway. Wait, wait, I'm going to. Wait, if those batteries are in parallel, put them in series, make it twice as fast. Right, we're going to have. It already says 24 volts in the motor. Never yeah. mind. Right, we're going to have some fun. So, yeah. Bro, we can put an engine on that. Don't want an engine on it. It's got, it's got it's a motor. Well. So, Rich did the electric scooter. Yes. It's all done in. Hang on, I'll just go and show him quick. Yeah. It's on charge. It's on charge. Uh, <coughs> but we haven't properly tested if this charge actually works. So, what we're going to do <coughs> is we're just going to give it a little quick test. We have a light. And. Test it out, see if we've got any talk. Oh, come on the camera. Oh, hello. It's just eating off by itself. So we have got. Right. <clears throat> see if it actually works, shall we? Okay, it's, it's getting some power, but. There you go, not, not a lot. I've got to charge it up some more. So we'll do that <clears throat> and get that charged up for the day. <clears throat> Shit, always breaking stuff. 
Negara tu. Right. So, need that charge now, and yeah, back out here to what we're doing out here. I'm back and well, basically, that. what I've done so far is I've put new fuel line on it, put the old vacuum line back on because there's nothing wrong with it. It's just a bit solid. Don't matter. It still makes a tight seal. Um, I sucked the fuel, oh, sucked the vacuum line, got all the fuel to bleed through into the carb, done that. Tightened up the clamp on the carb, topped up the oil, topped up the petrol. Already had loads of performance oil in it, which was fucking lit. Um, and we checked the spark, it's got amazing spark, lovely fucking spark, amazing spark. Lovely spark. Um, but the kickstart doesn't spring back, and I'm getting fucking fuming with it. <laughs> so I'm just gonna take this off again, see what I can do about it. Yeah, but all this was slack and everything, totting all that up. Try to wrap and take from that to stop it moving. It doesn't. I'm probably gonna weld it out there at some point. I find it's fucking annoying. <laughs> but yeah, so just taking this fucking thing off again, which was annoying to get on in the first place. Yeah. But, so. You know, how's everyone else's day going? Put it in the comments, you know. Yeah, isn't it? Put loads of stuff in the comments. Just yeah. comment. What we should, comment what we should do to it and also what we should put on a mini bike because yeah. anything can go on a mini bike. This bike here is owned by me and my friend Davey, this motorhead. Um, Davey paid for it, I've done all the work on it. We're going to sell it on in the future, but we can still use it for a while until we do end up selling it. Um, Davey doesn't even know we're working at the moment. He was going to be pleasantly surprised when he sees this if he watches my channel. But yeah. get this off quickly. The dowel pin down there that usually gets stuck. Yeah. Dowel pins always get stuck. So just... That one there, I had a bit of trouble getting it in earlier. Yeah, dowel pins always get stuck, so just let's get on. Tap. Right. That can just go back in. Do, do you remember last time we done this? Yeah. And we nearly right. broke it. In fact, we did break it, and that was why we had to. Uh, if you remember correctly, that's why we didn't. Have, we don't have a kickstart on the other one. So yeah. I don't careful. think it's the spring there that's the causing the problem. I think it's actually this. If I can wind the spring round one more time, put loads of spring tension on it. But that's what we tried last time, and that was how we fucked the other uh, kickstart. And we don't have. Well, we fucked it. It's just. And we don't have an electric start on this one. But I'm pretty sure it's this thing here, jumping up. So if I just push it out. Like that. Yeah, that's not really too bad. There's not much spring tension on it, but there's some. Yeah. So yeah. there's enough. It's all of this that needs all cleaning out, all in there. Give it a good lube up and clean, you know. It's gonna be hard to clean inside each individual tooth on there because I can't really get a wire brush or anything in there. But this I should manage, you know. But yeah, um, we'll see you in a minute, guys. When we've made some progress, putting yeah. panels and shit on. Not Why did it not stop recording? Rich is here putting panels and shit on because I'm he's a mechanic. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so far, what we've done is I've just tightened everything up down there. Um, Put the kickstarter up back together. Mm. We uh, found the actual starter bendix, which is amazing. Which, well, I've been putting all this back on because we just trying to use electric start. So, why well, we also put this back up here, button there. But we don't have a battery, so we didn't really think this through because we're still going to have to kickstart it. <laughs> have we got a little bolt, like little screw? Literally, uh -huh. like little screw. That's the part from the bottom, Don't know. Um, best. Oh no, it does go there, doesn't it? Yeah, this is this place. I just need to get this bit in here. What about the, why don't you put the carbon fiber thing on the back? Yeah, have you got the bolts for it? Yeah, there's loads of bolts in that red tray in there. Oh yeah, cause they. Oh, those, those aren't the bolts for it. The bolts stuck up for it underneath that bag. Yeah, fuck it, this will work. <laughs> right, that's what we need to work out where this goes. Through that hole there. Through that hole there. Okay. Yeah, forward. Forward. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, guys, we're just trying to put it back. To oh, I'll do it. Hold it for now, won't it? Just like that. No well, bolts. I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna do it. Put the bolts in anyway. Yeah, the bolts are. Oh. Oh. These. Pretty sure it's these. Is it or not? Yeah, it's in there. For the right length. Yeah. Try them. Are they even in place? Are they actually going into the holes or not? Yeah, they will do. Okay. Yeah, into the Go on, Richard. Are they screwing in something or not? Yeah. Oh, okay, sound. Mate, I never ever have problems getting it in the hole. <laughs> <laughs> Cheeky. Cheeky, any Hannah? Yeah, you never ever has problems getting it in the hole. <laughs> oh, it's every time. <laughs> Fucking professional, I am. Oh, Rich, I'm gonna put this as a thumbnail. Never mind the boy, wanna see my helmet. <laughs> <laughs> thumbnail boy. Oh, Rich, tell him why you got that hat, by the way. I got this hat. Yeah. I was at a lovely place, Milford on Sea. 
Uh, and it was on a bench. <laughs> so I took it, it was probably some child's, but I needed a hat, I was having a bad hair day, and I was in the middle of a city, I would, you know, a village or whatever the fuck it is, town. I don't know, it's from where my mum was from, so. Posh as fuck out there. <laughs> Posh it boys. Good. So all good, because the cafe we went to was Pokestop, so. Hey, Pokemon Go, boy. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. Fucking, you know what that is? Straight out of the factory, bro. Apparently, this thing can do 80 kilometers an hour. I'll get this thing doing 100 kilometers an hour. Yeah, same thing, <laughs> Fuel gauge. <laughs> yes, bro. I actually got a fuel gauge. And all these lights. Look at all these lights. I've got RPM gauge on a moped. <laughs> That's jokes. There's two strokes, to be fair, though. Might need it. Oh, Rich, I think I figured out what these little wires go to. What? Rear brake lights. And shit like that. Yeah, rear brake lights, yeah. We've got two of them. <laughs> Because there's two wires that come over here, magically, and there's little pictures there. The well, because... Screw it all in. No, screw the fucking light back on. Oh, seen. <laughs> it's got two tail lights, by the way, guys. It's got one there on this carbon thing. It's got some sick looking tail light. And then right it's got here. one that goes in there. So I, find a bolt. Uh, I don't know. I might put that as a LED light bar, bright white one, so I can reverse. Find them reversing. Um, are we, am I just literally find a fucking? Yeah, this is throwing the whole thing together, bro. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna see. Find a screw that goes in there. Maybe that one. Do you work? Yeah, work. It does. <laughs> I do work actually. I work on motorbikes. No, the fucking just talk to the screw. <laughs> I always talk to the Max load six kilograms. Chat shit. Six kilos? That's, my That's weight. fucking sturdy as fuck. So shut up. You know why it's so sturdy, yeah. isn't it? Because I don't know. You know why I don't know if it's so sturdy, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> right, so we bolt this on. As That'll do. That'll do. It won't do, will it? Just bolt it on. Bro, we need to work on the motorbike. We don't even know if it fucking runs yet, do we? We'll fucking test it then. We'll test it then. Oh, right, fuck it. Key time gone? Yep. Don't be a down syndrome about it. Did you fucking kick it or something? Well, it actually sounds like it wants to go. Oh my god, wait, wait, wait. Give it some throttle. Oh no, boys, actually. Oh, it's gonna go, it's gonna go, it's gonna go. <gasps> no. Come on. No way. Fuck it, let's go again. What the fuck? Look how smoke it is though. Yeah, we need to clear that, but it fucking works. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> um, try again. Try again. Fuck it. See if we get it. Second time. Lucky. Oh Ready? my fucking god. Which is because I'm a mechanic. I did first time. Watch. Ready? Oh, so close. <gasps> The PM gauge doesn't work, guys. Nothing works. Oh. These lights do, though. Fuel light works, sure. We have no fuel in. That's a lie. We know we've got fuel in here. It's probably flashing because no battery connected. So when we connect to the battery, it'll work. Wait, yeah. why are all the dash lights turned on? How do we even turn them off? There's no switch there. That's the indicators. There's a switch missing. Look, guys, switch and missing. So how That's we... always going to be handy. How do we turn these dash lights off? They're all turned on. And she oh. died. It died, but I'm going to leave it turned off. I ain't going to run it again. Oh, it's bare smoky. Do you reckon it's bad oil? Do you reckon it's... Uh, it could be where it's old oil? I reckon it's fucking just hung over, mate. I reckon just give it a bit of a clean and it'll be alright, right? Yeah. That's what you call hung over pet. Well, now we know it runs, bolt the side on. Let's put it... Make it look like a moped. Let's make it look like a fucking... <laughs> 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 Let's make it look like a fucking moped. Also, that back wheel's probably going to fit, hopefully, because that one's got punctures and it's on the threads and it's on everything. It's just not going to work. So, yeah. Madness! I'm well excited. I'm fucking... <clears throat> I'm yeeting. Wait, let me put this front thing in. It looks a bit better. Wait. It looks a bit better. It looks shit to Shut the fuck up. Oh! <laughs> yeah. <Fuck> off. <laughs> what screw does that take? Is it a long one? Nah, it's a normal screw, but there's a metal clip missing that holds behind it. I'll find one, put it in there somehow. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna stop recording for a bit. We're gonna make some progress, and I'm gonna go kill myself. Oh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> so, um, oh, so yeah, yeah, crack on. Means I get a moped. Yeah, it's sick. Right, it's see you guys in a bit. A bit late now. Um, I'm tired. up and do a few more bits, but I figured out why the Piaggio wasn't running properly to an extent, but not completely. It was actually getting too much fuel, I haven't actually taken apart the carburetor yet. But I've cleaned the air filter and I've done a little modification to the box to make it a little bit more inductive. Not much, because with just the sponge pressed in, it ran pretty fucking good. Um, but yeah. Also, I've done a few little bits to it now, which I will just quickly show you. So as you can see, 
There it is. The signature mark for all my bikes. The old 4.6. Um, ain't done much in the world well, of looks, apart from also cut the tail tidy thing off. Got to make it look clean, ain't you? Um, all of you thought I was hiding the number plate when it was sat at the back here. I wasn't, it was just the indicator of dangling over it. Never had to hide it, never needed to. Um, got it running today, so that's always good. Had no problems getting it running. Just got to reinstall this air filter on the other side with my modified box, which I'll show you here. And what I did is I'll just take it some daylight. See, so, I'm a lot of daylights. Oh, wait, I've got a torch on my phone, anyway. That's what I'm recording with. Uh, what I did is I just cut the end bit off so it sucks air from the atmosphere here. Then goes through the filter and everything, not through those two holes, but through the top and those two holes. Actually saying that, it has to go through those two holes. So I'm going to cut a bit more out there. Okay. Um, <laughs> anyway, it has to go through there and then through the sponge and into the engine. The sponge has been fully cleaned out as much as it's stained. I fully fucking scrubbed this for hours. And I can safely say that it doesn't feel greasy at all. That's still a bit wet there. Don't matter, I'm not going to run the pet tonight. Um, but yeah, still, that's all just wet rather than oily. But it's also stained, you know? But all in all, I can safely put my face to it and shit like that. It's not oily anymore and it's not wet and it's not dirty. It's clean. That's what matters, because that was full of oil. The airbox was. Which is one more problem. Um, so yeah, that's what it all looks like down there. And another problem I had was the throttle cable was too tight. Loosen that up a little bit. I cleaned off that cylinder a little bit with a screwdriver. Just got all the bits of big rust out. Um, not I can be bothered, I'm either going to buy a ball kit or I'm going to just clean that up hard and then paint it with heat proof paint because I don't want a rusty ball. Me no likey. Me no likey rust at all. Um, but yeah, it kicks first, kick now every time and it's just so easy. Also, had to put that stick on there, didn't I? Because if you don't know, my GSX had 46 on the screen and that sticker on the right hand rear panel. So I put it on the black moped out the front and I put it on this moped. It's just a memory, really, in it, because the GSX got nicked. Yeah. Oh, there's Rich. Hi, Hello, Rich. Hello. I'm on YouTube. You are on YouTube, bro. YouTube. Bit late for YouTube, but we're yeah. on it. Yeah. Um. I was gonna. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah. yeah so. I was gonna well, see. we're up to top secret business in the background here, boys. Yeah, it's a bit, a bit personal. Yeah. So a bit. We have be be putting all over the internet. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm joking, guys. I've just got. I've just got to go and meet my mum. But you know when we talk about that on yeah, yeah, I mean, YouTube. <laughs> yeah, bit gay, isn't it? Bit, bit gay. Yeah, but yeah, just gonna put the effort in, tidy up, and that's it. So I'm not really gonna record any more of this. Just gonna say no night now to you boys. And also, <laughs> look at my tomato plants and fucking you. <laughs> oh my god, your eyes were well red. Yeah, Wait, look at the camera. Me. Oh my god, what? devil. What? Right, what? see you guys another day.